Now, I found a little article here. Uh, I think it's part of the steel tower being delivered, but this, I believe, is an article on the same wind farm that I got the stealth videos of the turbine blades. Uh, it's being made at Mount Mercer. It is not the biggest one in Australia, like I said. I stuffed up big time. It's just the first one locally near me um, in you know my local government area. Um, it should power a city of around about 200,000 people. They said it is expected to create more than 400 gigawatt hours of energy um, a year. And this is just a little uh, bit of a rant on who's doing it and when they're moving it and a few other technicalities on it. Um, it says there's 64 nacelles. Now it says up here the nacelle is the housing which sits on top of the tower, um, which I assume is your generator box, and they weigh 69 ton each. Um, the steel tower sections are 25 metres long, three sections per turbine. The blades are 45 metres long. It says on this side of the page they're steel blades, and on the other side it says they're fiberglass. Um, usually you get steel um, and sort of stick it inside of fiberglass for your aerofoils on your trucks because I've done that as a job for a short while. Um, but they're probably both. Um, yeah, and it rants on about all the uh, local companies that are involved in doing it. Um, but I believe the ones I got the stealth videos of at 11 p.m. at night um, were for this Mount Mercer wind farm, but I might go out there um, and do a little bit more videoing on that at a later date. Um, and yeah, you'll get to see a few of those as well.